Let's go. Last night about 10 p.m., we were in our hotel, which is not quite 20 kilometers north of where I'm standing, and an incredibly huge blast hit the building so hard that I thought a car had hit the cabin that we were in. And uh, so we ran outside, and it f turned out it was actually very far away. It was here. This is a village called Bila Serka, Serkva. <laughs> and it's, this is a, a warehouse that's not a military target. It was not, you know, holding soldiers or anything like that. But it's about half a mile from a military base. And the Russians keep saying that they are only firing precision uh, warheads in this fight, but as you can see, this is not very precise. So the warehouse took the brunt of the explosion and it was absolutely devastating to the building itself and to all the surrounding buildings as well. Uh, we're gonna, I'm, I'm just gonna walk through here and take a look, I have to keep, uh, my eyes on where my feet are because there are lots of sharp objects and nails and things like that that are in uh, on the on the ground this is part of the roofing that was torn off right here and the cladding on the side of the building just ripped right off this building is obviously uh, structurally compromised be careful there and th i'm walking through piles of uh insulation I, I guess this is that it were blown off the building you can see where it damaged the wall to the extent that this whole part of the wall caved in on top of some machinery that is visible underneath these these big slabs of concrete that fell down. And look over here. This is the crater where the bomb hit. I would estimate that that was at least a 500 pound bomb, very likely, uh, to leave a crater that size through reinforced concrete and steel. The size of some of this rebar here is easily one inch rebar uh, and it absolutely just punched a hole right through it. There are still some things burning. Last night there was a, quite a bit of fire here. We got images just after midnight of this warehouse uh, as the you know workers here came to check out the damage. Windows for probably a half mile in every direction have been blown out. Uh, all kinds of ha homes and workshops. Again, this is not a military target. This is a civilian warehouse. The military target is a half mile away. And if they're only firing precision fires, that tells us that they're not very well trained. They're not very precise. And that's why we're seeing so much civilian misery and so many civilian casualties in this war. Okay.